So here's how they so figured out to do it, right? So take like a pipette, right? And okay. fill it with tin. And you're going to get these tin droplets to drop down through this machine. Really, really small droplets. Okay. Uh -huh. You can mess with how often they drop or how the little droplets hit the bus. You got these bubbles of tin dropping through this machine. Okay. Now you take a, a laser, a really small laser, and you, you target these tin drops as they're following. The laser shoots at the tin droplet, flattens it. And then shoots again, and it heats it up and makes it ready to explode. And it hits a third time, right? And it explodes. And when it explodes, it creates a little bit of a reaction that throws a photon in one direction. The photon bounces off seven mirrors, right? And gets then uh, it, it gets exposed on the loth lithography. Okay. So as an engineer, what I want you to do is I'm going to drop a liquid. I want you to take a laser shine it or aim it towards a, a little tin droplet, hit it three times consecutively, so enough so that it explodes, it creates a photon that bounces a bunch of mirrors and then impresses it on a silicon slab, right? In midair. In midair. And guess how many times a second these things are hit three times? I don't know. 50,000 times per second, these little tin particles, little tin droplets are hit with a laser three consecutive times to emit a photon to do the lithography on the uh, the silicon wafer.